What's going on guys? Vic VP back with another Game Case Arcades video. On this one today, we're going to retrofit and fix this Pac-Man machine. So off the bat, some people are going to be very upset when I'm going to do this Pac-Man machine, but basically we have a non-working Pac-Man Galaga machine. Um, I can't tell if it's the screen and I can't tell if it's the board maybe. I'm not too sure, but definitely right now, this game is out of commission. It doesn't work. The screen does have burn in. The screen turns on and it's kind of weird. It brings up like the Galaga screen, but Pac-Man goes to white. It'll bring up Pac-Man, but then Galaga goes to the white screen. So I can't really tell if it's a screen issue or if it's a board issue. Um, as you can see, it is pretty beat up. Jerry, you have I do have this in my facility. I do have a, a large facility in Astoria. So this is actually in one of my soccer fields. And this is honestly one of the most money-making games. Uh, people enjoy the classic Pac-Man four-way joysticks on this. And you can just tell it's pretty beat. Let me flip the camera around before we start. So I've retrofitted uh, maybe three of these in the past. I'm gonna do it with you guys on this one. Basically, again, as you can see, it's a great cabinet. Control panel is beat though. I mean. Overlay, it looks like whoever had it previously put an overlay on top of an overlay. The joystick works good. The button is kind of loose, but that's an easy fix. It just really shows wear and tear on this. Um, basically, again, it's a pretty nice cabinet. It's tucked away into the corner. Again, we have a very big facility. There's a soccer field, and again, it's nice. It's just, you know, there is a lot of screen burning. You could definitely see the screen burning on this. I mean, this right here had to be here for at least maybe three years i would say and i've never serviced it i've just taken the money out of it and now i think you know after time it has now gone and it's uh time to fix it you kind of see like the t-molding t-molding actually it looks like the cabinet cabinet is actually splitting you could actually see it um again the t-molding as you can see, I could literally squeeze this. I mean, that's the right side. Left side of the cabinet is pretty good. I mean, it is scuffed up. Basically, we're gonna pull this out. And again, some people are not gonna like what I'm gonna do to this, but basically, I bought a Game Elf. This is gonna have a 412 strictly vertical games to it. Uh, we're gonna be moving. I'm gonna try to keep the existing joystick, which I really do like. We're gonna move it over put our four or three buttons, I'm not too sure what the game elf requires, start buttons, and we're gonna have this back up and functioning. Purchase a 24 inch monitor on this. Again, vertical going up and down. The bezel, the monitor I got after the measurement, the bezel will stay. So we're not gonna be taking apart this. This will stay. The screen will just basically be replaced. And again, just a little preview of what's going to come in the next couple of videos. We're basically going to bring it out. We're going to gut it. We're going to see what we could do about this kind of flex here. I mean, again, not too bad. Pac-Man Galaga machine going next. So again, I planned ahead. I saw the screen break me about two weeks ago. I saw that. Um, had to give a couple of quarters back because people actually put money in that. But basically, real quick. We do have our Game Elf. We ordered it on eBay. I believe it cost me about a hundred bucks. And on this one, again, Game Elf Vertical. I believe I have my list here. I have my Game Elf list here and I believe it's going to hit, yeah, 412. 412 games on this. The, pl the plan is to fix it and basically put it on let go or craigslist this way it goes i mean again um i have the uh power supply i'm gonna try to use the existing buttons on it if not led buttons from game room solutions of spares that i have so as of right now we will do a cost breakdown but just a quick update what's coming soon pac-man into a game elf